welcome to my studio. This is Michelle Yusavelli here coming to you from Washington State. I live in the town of Woodway, which is about 12 miles north of downtown Seattle, where I live with my husband and three teenagers and a dog named Duke. Because I am schooled in architecture and technical drawing, my challenge when I first started was creating really tight, uh, linear, hard edge paintings and for the first couple of years I was painting my goal was to loosen up and to get a freedom and emotion, emotion and a movement in my work um, that I just couldn't do by rendering really tight clipped um, paintings so that was a real goal of mine is to create my own signature style to be impressionistic and loose and to let the energy of the brush stroke and the color really show through and, and to kind of capture the viewer um, by using all of those elements of fresh brush strokes beautiful clean color and and also really working on leaving out just as much as I put into a painting. I think I would call myself a perfectionist. Uh, it's really important to me that any painting that leaves my studio, I am 110% satisfied with it. Um, I won't let anything go until it, it meets my level of expectation. And I want my collectors, I want my galleries, um, I want anybody who I come and have a connection with professionally to, to know that um, I will always put forth my best work and if it's not then then um, I won't put it out there and in fact my kids and I have every six months or so we have a canvas wrecking party where we take old pieces that were uh, studies or uh, artwork that I just don't want out there that I don't I don't think exemplifies the best I can do and we'll actually we'll rip them up if they're on canvas we'll slash them with exacto knives or we'll burn ones that are on board so um, it's kind of our a little ritual that we go through and um, just showing my kids too that you know take pride in what you do and work your hardest and have a goal and be fair and honest and um, make sure that everything you do is you're at your highest level of expectation. There really is not a subject matter that doesn't interest me. And it might be a still life, it might be a landscape, a figurative work. I'm always drawn to urban scenes, I think primarily because I have such a background in architecture. I, I love the perspective and vanishing point and the challenges that an urban scene bring. But my goal now is to create a unified body of work regardless of the fact that I'm painting different subject matter, um, I am very focused on creating a body of work that is timeless, um, a body of work that says it's mine, that speaks to me, that carries my own signature style. And um, like I say, I, I have to have the freedom to paint whatever inspires me at the moment, I, I almost see the world in pixels. I, I see my world in spots of color and dark and light and warm and cool value, um, hard edges and soft edges. So in that regard, it's it's just a it's a group of shapes. It's not really objects. I'm just inspired by the light and shadows and capturing day to day vignettes of life and not I just want people to look at my work and 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 smile and, and hopefully evoke a memory or emotion something that will uh, speak to them about a place or a time or an instant um, that that brings back a, a happy memory for them